Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So we are taking a walk into Old Navy today. I was recently like cruising on their website and I saw a couple things that maybe had some potential, but I will have everything listed and linked for you down below, starting off with a couple of really beautiful dresses. So I'm sure you guys are gonna be a little bit surprised to see uh, color <laughs> on this channel, you guys know. I just love my neutrals, but every once in a while, a bold color just kind of like grabs my attention. Now, truth be told, on the website, this was showing as like a really deep, true burgundy, which I was so drawn towards. In person and hopefully on camera, it's showing up true to color, which is actually a deep purple. But gotta tell you, love, oh my goodness, this dress. Honestly, I put it on and I was like, wait a minute, this is not 100% cotton. This has to be like a cotton modal blend and it's not. It is cotton with a touch of spandex, but I have never felt anything like this before in my life. It is stunning on. It just has this beautiful weight to it that feels so luxurious. Obviously, you have those spaghetti straps. You have the tiered skirt. This is a midi length. What makes this garment really interesting is the back. So you don't have any traditional metal clasps on the straps to make them adjustable, but what they did was they came up with this tie design in the back. So you basically tighten this to then tighten the straps and also pull the garment up in the front. Super interesting, and while I didn't obviously have it on for like hours at a time, at least during the try-on, I didn't feel like it was budging or anything like that. So I think a garment like this, as long as you tie this securely, you will be absolutely fine. So speaking of cotton clothing, if you guys are new to my channel, I've been flipping all synthetics out of my closet in favor of natural fibers. And in the summertime, I love cotton, organic cotton, and linen the most. So everything you see here today is going to be comprised of 100% cotton clothing. Now this next dress here looks like something similar that we see all the time on this channel. Obviously it's another spaghetti strap dress. You do have a nice little v-neck in the front that doesn't go too far. And then you also have another one with pockets. But what makes this one so interesting to me is that it is a maxi length so typically when I find dresses like this they're a midi I almost never see maxi dresses like this this cotton feels so lightweight perfect for summer it just feels really good on and I will say it runs a little bit big this one is my normal size small but if you are not like exceptionally blessed up top I would say you can probably definitely size down and be absolutely fine. But one of the things I love about this dress, again, she is like such a great option for wearing to any special event you have coming up in the summertime. Do you have a wedding? Do you have a baby shower? Do you have an anniversary party? Whatever the case may be, throw this on with some great jewelry, a gorgeous pair of heeled sandals, and you are going to look like you are ready for any event. It is gorgeous. Okay, so this next dress turned out not to be one of my favorites, and I'll explain why in a minute, but it is another midi length, 100% cotton. I did go with my normal size small. I did not like all of this smocking across the bodice and also the straps. I know that's gonna sound surprising to a lot of you because normally we love smocking on this channel. There's something about the fabric of this smocking, the way it was designed, that feels very, very tight on the bodice. I don't particularly like that. Um, so this is a no-go for me. But if you're not opposed to a little bit more of a fitted look when it comes to smocking on the bodice, check it out. It has a beautiful fit to it. Otherwise, it's another breezy cotton style. This is a midi length. And you also have this opening in the back, which I'm noticing a lot of this season. But this is another style that also does not have adjustable straps. So just keep that in mind.
Okay, so speaking of straps, this was another one that I did have some issues with. And before I forget to mention too, I don't know what's going on with Old Navy, but their prices as compared to retailers like Target and Walmart are definitely like starting to tick up there. It's a darling chambray. I mean, perfect for the summertime. It's got this really sweet fit to it. Now this one does come with a squared off neckline, which I love. You have some gathering at the waist. She is a mini length, so it's gonna hit like right around your mid thigh, just depending on how tall you are. Another one with pockets, another one that has this really sweet tie detail in the back that just functions as a bow. And then as you just saw, this is another style that does come with a tiny little cutout in the center of the back. Now for me personally, the issue I had with this dress was the straps. Because they're not adjustable, I felt like they were constantly threatening to just slip off my shoulders, which I did not like. But this one does run true to size and I did get my normal size small. Okay, next up is a great pair of shorts. I have an olive pair in my collection, but I was looking to see if maybe there's another style I wanted to add. So I grabbed their everyday design. Now this is a three and a half inch inseam, but what's nice is you can unroll these. These cuffs aren't tacked, so you can get a little bit more length if that's what you're comfortable with. It is a zip fly, a little bit higher of a rise, and then you also have functional front pockets. Now you do also have functional back pockets and then you have that elasticized waist. For me, these just fit really odd. I got my normal size small, which typically in bottoms, I'm a size four, six. And I just felt like this area right here was creating like this bulk in my lower stomach. And I do have a little bit of a lower stomach, but I felt like this was really exaggerating it. So this was not the cut for my body type, but I will say they are super comfortable on. Now to style these, I specifically wanted to find like a little bit of an oversized white cotton shirt and I love a slub knit. I just love the way it looks and the way it feels. It tends to have a little bit more substance to it than a traditional like paper thin cotton shirt. And I gotta tell you, Old Navy does their 100% cotton tees, whether short sleeve, long sleeve, or like a tank, really, really well. They're some of the best, especially for the price points. So this one here, it is what it is. It's just a traditional crew neck. It has a normal sleeve. There's no cuffing at the end of that sleeve. And then it just is a classic in the back as well a little bit longer so it's easy to wear untucked or tucked Okay guys, and two more things to show you, both of which are white dresses. Oh my gosh, what a shock. <laughs> Can we get through a single video on this channel without featuring a white cotton dress? No, we cannot. So I have specific white cotton dresses in my collection that worked for me last year, and this year I'm kind of like, meh, meh, a little bit wishy-washy about. So I'm potentially looking to replace those with some new ones. So I wanted to see this style here. Now this is a style we've seen quite a bit on this channel. It just tends to be a timeless class in most retailers collections each spring and summer season you have that crew neck it's just a traditional short sleeve and then you have that tiered ruffle skirt and nothing crazy going on in the back now this one is a little bit sheer so of course always stick with your nude undergarments but this is another one that I felt ran a little bit big went with my normal size small and absolutely could have size down to an extra small. But it's another great sweet dress that's super easy to dress up if you want to go out for a night on the town, but it's gonna look just as good for a casual day as well. Okay guys, and the final outfit for today's preview from Old Navy is another white cotton dress. Again, no big surprise. So this one here is a little bit longer. I would say it's a longer midi style. It's almost like between a midi and a maxi, at least on me, and I'm five feet four and a half. 
love the puff sleeve oh my gosh you guys they actually lined the puff with a cotton lining which feels so luxurious on the skin this is a beautifully done dress again with that squared off neckline which i love you have a higher empire waist this does have pockets and then they also added this nice little ruffled tier at the bottom of the hem now this is a style that has a very comfortable soft smocking in the back which is going to give you a really beautiful fit and i love how they went with the squared off design in the back as well just super pretty touch this looks gorgeous on another great option to have in your arsenal if you do have some fun events coming up you want to wear something to church on sunday whatever the case may be this is a great affordable option that you can wear time and time again oh i also want to mention this also is lined it's partially lined with a cotton lining the lining ends right about here which hits me around the knee area so it's going to give you a little bit more coverage to ensure that your undergarments aren't going to be peeking through through, but again, always stick with a nude undergarment because that is going to be your safest bet. Okay guys, so that'll do it for the latest and greatest from Old Navy. And I have to admit something, you guys are probably going to laugh. But this dress here, because I was kind of disappointed that the color wasn't a true burgundy, which is what I'm looking for, nevertheless was so in love with the design and the style of this that I went back onto Old Navy's website and I saw that this actually comes in white, yellow, and black, which I will link down below because I grabbed all three of them. They were on sale, it seemed like a great option, plus they are going to fill specific holes in my closet, which I've been looking to do. But as I said before, in addition to those three dresses I just ordered, I will have all of these listed and linked for you down below. But in any event, thank you guys so much for spending your time with me today. I hope you're having a good one, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.